Hey geeks, today I've got two juicy bits to talk about regarding Godzilla x Kong, the new empire. Trust me, you're going to want to stick around for this. The big question on everyone's mind. After his latest showdown, will Godzilla go back to his old self? And here's something else to chew on. Did Godzilla just get a makeover or is there more to it? Like a change in his person? We've got a lot to unpack here, so let's dive in. Now, when talking about Godzilla's latest form, some folks are calling it a transformation, but hey, let's get our terms straight. A transformation is a big immediate change. Think caterpillar to butterfly, but evolution. That's a whole different ballgame. It's a slow burn, a gradual shift that often means improvement or adaptation. So in Godzilla's case, I'd say we're looking at an evolution, not just a quick switcheroo. But here's the kicker. If this is a true evolution, can Godzilla even go back to his old form? Think Pokemon rules here. Once they evolve, there's no going back. If Godzilla's change is more like an ability he's picked up though, then yeah, he could remember burning Godzilla. That was an ability, not an evolution. He powered up, did his thing, and then went back to normal. But wait, there's more. Evolution isn't just about physical changes. It can totally revamp your mind and personality too. From the snippets we've seen in the trailer, Godzilla seems way more aggressive and less of the chill giant lizard we know. He's like a wild titan now. And that could mean his mental state has shifted along with his physical. So what does this all mean for the movie? My bet is Godzilla starts off normal, then goes through this whole evolution thing after getting zapped with some funky pink radiation. But after all of the epic battles and chaos, I think he'll be spent and revert to his original form. Just a hunch. Now, if I had it my way, I'd love to see Godzilla start normal, then go absolutely berserk. After the radiation exposure, taking on every kaiju he meets. Imagine him getting stronger and more uncontrollable with each battle, ending the movie as a complete wild card. That would set up an insane Godzilla 3 with everyone trying to bring back the Godzilla we know and love. But hey, that's just me daydreaming. What about you? Do you think Godzilla's change is permanent or just a temporary power-up? And what scenario would you love to see? Hit me up in the comments. I'm dying to know your thoughts. And don't forget, if you're loving these deep dives into the MonsterVerse, smash that subscribe button. Your support keeps us going and bringing you the coolest content every day. Drop a like too, and let's spread some joy in the world of Beta Geek News. We'll catch you in the next video, folks.